Things were going great at Santa Verde Academy. Two months in, and everything seemed nice. That is, until one inevitable week came. During this week, love was our biggest enemy, and it didn't stop. But some it was joyful, while others, like myself, hated every moment. Either way, I'll never forget how crazy this week was. It was the week everyone caught the love bug. superpowers and control, it's time to discuss superhuman chemistry. Step 1 of cultivating the perfect superhero team. What does chemistry have to do with this, Miss Juniper? A lot actually, Chesley. You see guys, one day during your fourth and final year here at the academy, you'll have to start thinking about plans for a team. One way to alleviate that search for other members is to befriend some of your fellow classmates. That's where chemistry comes in. As a team, you've got to work cohesively. You must know one another and be able to deal with each other at all times. Your friendship should be the basis of the team's success. Miss Juniper, doesn't that kind of chemistry lead to, you know, romance? Sometimes, Decker. Sometimes. While I'm aware of that inevitability, I do advise you guys to just be careful with romance when it comes to friendship. Sometimes it screws with your better judgment. Ring, 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 ring! Well, that's it for today, kids. We'll continue our study on superhuman chemistry tomorrow. D -d -d Look out! Ah! Ow! Whoops! Sorry about that, Federico. It's cool, bro. No harm done. Cool. Well, I'd better get going. I've got some serious studying to do. See, si. Lots of studying. See you later. Ah, adios, sexy. Uh, you white, son? Okay, uh, yeah, I'm good, amigo. Just slightly distracted. Let me guess. Deco? See, si, amigo, he's so hot. I just wish I knew if he was gay or not. Why don't you just ask him? And you can't just ask someone, are you gay, on the spot. I asked you, didn't I? That's different. We were alone and I was more inclined, to be honest. It's all about timing. I see. Well, while you do that, I'm finally gonna go tell Chesley about my feelings for her. Nice! She's probably anticipating it right now. No, I haven't told him yet. Again, I don't want to hurt his feelings! Chesley, you're already hurting his feelings by prolonging the reveal to him. Tell Andy sooner rather than later, remember? We talked about this last week. I remember, but like I said, I don't want to hurt Andy. The fact that he likes me doesn't help the situation either. Simply telling him that you and I are a thing could make things awkward. No way! You two are dating? Ah! Where did you come from? 
I got curious and decided to look for you guys, assuming you were together. Apparently, you're more together than I thought. I knew I smelled a mood between you two. Chesley, this is a good thing. Now that Federico knows, all you have to do is tell Andy. Couldn't you or me just do that? We could, but it's Chesley that Andy likes. I find it more simplistic and natural if Andy learned about this from her rather than someone else. But don't you? No. Be strong and tell him. He'll get over it. I don't know, Tachu. Andy didn't just say like. He said love. You're, You're not, not helping. helping! Oops. Lo siento. Look, I've got some meditating to do. In the meantime, you need to consider telling Andy ASAP. <gasps> okay. You know, there is a way to break the news to him. Dare I ask? How so? Andy plans on confessing to you later on tonight. Tell him right there before he gets to say anything. Federico, isn't there a way to do this without hurting him? Nope. You'll just have to face this issue head on. I'll be there for moral support if you want. No. I'll deal with it myself. This is going to suck. Good luck, compadre. Hey, Chesley. Uh, hey, Andy. So I take it Federico told you to meet me here, right? Yeah. He said you had something important to tell me. I do, son. <laughs> Chesley, I think I'm... Um, before you say anything, I have something to say as well. Do you mind if I go first? Oh, okay, son. I don't mind. Cool. Truth is... I... I... You... What? Go on and say it. I'm dating Tachio! Wait, what? I wanted to tell you sooner, but I was afraid to hurt your feelings. I... I... <laughs> it's cool. Is it really? Or are you hurt? Chesley hurts, but I'll get over it. You're happy with him, right? Yes. Then I'm happy for you, son. I hope you two enjoy one another. I'll see you later. Andy, wait! I... <sighs> I heard him, didn't I? Gosh darn it, Chesley! <laughs> Dang it! Dang it! Why me? I thought for a second that I actually had a chance with a girl. But I was wrong, son. I was thinking wrong. And to think I was going to say I loved her. Real talk. Love is some bullcrap. Andy? Andy? Come on, amigo. We've got class in 30 minutes. And I'd like it if we could eat something before basic combat. She's dating. Tachio. Ah, so I guess you found out, huh? Wait, you knew? Why didn't you tell me? Chesley wanted to tell you herself. Sorry, bro. It's fine, dude. What's done is done. All I can do now is put a smile on my face and move on. Are you sure you'll be okay around the two lovebirds all the time? No, I'm not sure about that. But we were friends before lovers, right? I've got to at least try. Your optimism is admirable. Now can we please get some food? Estoy hambriento. Hey, son. We'll leave as soon as I get dressed. So then I said, Look out! Ah! Ugh. The bat escalated quickly. Oh my gosh! I'm sorry. Oh, so sorry. Ow. Oh, it's cool. Can you get off me, compadre? Oh, oh, whoops. Sorry about that. I was in a rush. Speaking of that, I gotta go. Bye! Okay, bye. Bye? Since when did Decca become such a klutz? I don't know. Hey guys! Uh, hey, Andy. Hey, what's up guys? Hola amigos! So I take it you know about Chesley and I. Yeah, no fun. In case you're wondering, I'm okay with it. Glad to hear it, buddy. So, why does Decca keep crashing into you? 
Yeah, I'm curious about that too. This has been going on for three weeks now. Looks like your stupid relationship. Say hey, what? what? Oh crap! I'm sorry, son. I didn't mean to say that. Uh, uh I'm the class early. Peace out. Awkward. Now oh, I'm worried again. I hope Andy is okay. Ah, uh, better go for the last time, you pervert. Keep your shirt on. Have some decency. Oh, come on, guys. You should be used to this by now. The backstabber technique is more of a trust method. With this move, the receiver can potentially get hurt if what he or she says comes with hesitation, which would imply they're in denial about something. That gives the attacker an advantage to hit them headfirst. The key is to be honest, or face the wrath of a fist, kick, or both right in your face. You certainly don't want that. Now it's time to practice this technique. Pair up with your sparring partner and give it a shot. I'll be the attacker. You can be the receiver. Fine by me. Let's do this. Andy, are you prepared for what I'm about to ask you? Whatever it is, I guarantee you it won't affect me, aight? Just hit me with your best shot, son. If you say so. Are you jealous of Chesley and I? I... Uh... You're open. Uh, ow! Ow! What the hell? You were hesitating and lost focus. Therefore, I successfully hit you. Forget that! Why did you ask that particular question? Because what Mr. Winters failed to mention was that the attacker also had a job to trigger a distraction with his or her words. That's the only way the technique works. He didn't say it because the trick is to have trust in one another. You obviously have no trust in me right now. Yes, I do! They're open again! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Ow! Dang it! I'm telling the truth! Andy, you need to stop acting like a child and be a man. Admit that you're in denial. Uh, shut up! Uh, 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 <laughs> Sorry, Andy, but the truth hurts sometimes. You need to accept that before you lose a good friend or two. <sighs> Why me? So what's on your mind? Chesley? She's all I could think about lately. Come to find out that she has a boyfriend. Now I'm pissed because she's with someone else, but I don't want her to know that. Then I'd be seen as a petty jealous guy. Then tell her how you feel about the relationship. Don't bottle up the hatred and hold on to it. I guarantee you'll feel a lot better being honest about your feelings. You don't want to lose that friendship, do you? No, of course not. Then you might want to go down the path of honesty. I... Thanks for the advice, Mr. Toshiro. I really appreciate it. No problem, Andy. Glad I could help. <sighs> Here goes nothing. Uno momento! Be there in a moment! Huh? Hola, Decker. What's up? Hey, do you mind if I come in and talk to you for a moment? It's important. Sure, bro. Come on in. Okay, Compositi. The floor is yours. Federico... Uh, I'm gay. Gay? I've been hiding this secret for three years. I had to tell someone. Why me? It's because I lo I mean, I, I trust you. Federico, I admired you and your bravery when coming out as bisexual. In fact, it inspired me to start being myself. Muy bien, bro. It's nice to know there's someone else like me around here. Also, for being honest, Decker, I, I like you. A lot. Funny you should say that. I like you too. A lot. Wait! Not yet. Why not, mi amor? It's obvious we like each other. I want us to get to know each other. I've been nothing more than an admirer. I want you to get to know the real Decker Highlander. Is that okay? See, si, mi amor. I can wait as long as you want. 
I shall get to know the real Federico Montez in the meantime. Cool. So I guess I'll see you later. I guess so. Unless you come back for that kiss. <laughs> Sounds tempting. See you later. Hasta pronto, mi amor. <laughs> Tengo un novio. Es tan guapo y caliente. Ah, decorous, mi amor. <laughs> here we are again. Yeah, it's really weird how we keep meeting here. But this time I have something to say. Okay, so what is it? Jesse, I love you. A lot. I know that means nothing to you at this point, but I need to be honest with you. I was hurt by your sudden relationship with Tachio. I'm really happy for you, but I'm also jealous. Not because I have a right to be, but it's because Tachio was lucky to have a beautiful girl like you. Love may be out of the question, but can we still be best friends? Who said I wanted to stop? <laughs> then it's settled. Let's put this love BS behind us, I Sounds good to me, dude. Now that we're done with the awkward stuff, you mind catching me up on what you were going through last week? Real talk, Chesley, it was a hot mess. Hey, Federico. Decorous, mi amor. You I do? See si, amigo. Decker came out and wants a relationship with me. Nice! That's what's up, son. So how did your talk with Chesley go? Pretty good. We're cool now. Awesome. What about your crush on her? I still care about her, but it's time to move on. Besides, I came here to become the world's strongest superhero, remember? And I'll be there for that epic moment right by your side. Exactly, son. Nothing, not even love, can stand in the way of my journey to the top. Huh? Who could that be? Huh? Hope? Hey, what's up, girl? I haven't seen you since last week. I know. I've been avoiding you for a while, and I apologize for that. I had to forgive myself, and realize that what happened between us was an accident. Again, sorry about the wounds. Hope you don't have to apologize anymore. I'm just glad to hear from you again. We're friends after all. We are? Of course we are! Wow. No one's ever called me their friend before. Thanks, Andy. No problem. After all, that's what friends are for, right? Right. <laughs> Thanks for making me smile. Being my anchor. And now calling me your friend. You're one swell guy, Andy Green. Thanks, Hope. <sighs> Thanks a lot. So the love bug struck and went away peacefully. After that, things began to return to normal. Well, sorta. Of. Some of us loved, lost, found their soulmate, or in my case, learned a valuable lesson in superhuman chemistry.
consumers are randomly disappearing. What's up with that, son? I find that to be unacceptable. It's time to take action. I'm taking a stand. You weren't supposed to reveal the title yet. Whoops. My apologies. This is my first time doing this. Next, next time, time, Isaac, Isaac takes, takes a stand. stand. See you guys next time on the Emerald Chronicles.